Roberts, the American Viking, is back in the proving ground. Oh, man, I'm going to tell you what. There is, that is one big dude over there. He likes beating people up. He likes hurting people. He likes scaring small children. I love this guy. He's my hero, Alex Rudolph. I tell you what. He is one big, nasty, ugly, smelly Viking. But I tell you another thing. He could beat ass on people and win wrestling matches. And we said this was a night of debuts, Jim. How about this? Cody Lane in the proving ground. Cody Lane, Cody Lane making his proving ground pro debut here at Bunkers, Iliopolis, Illinois tonight. All the way from Oklahoma, this kid wants it in the worst way. He knew he was facing this big, ugly Viking. He didn't care. He couldn't get to the proving ground fast enough, Jim. Well, this guy, I tell you what, he came all the way from Oklahoma. He could be finding the uh, Iliopolis Hospital facing a just a maniac by the name of Alex Rudolph. Well, I tell you what, we know what Alex Rudolph can do because we've seen him in the proving ground before. Cody, Cody Lane, we don't know much. We know he comes in here with a great reputation. We know this guy is really making waves on the indie scene, but, but Alex Rudolph, what a monster of a man at the face of your debut at the proving ground. Well, I tell you, I think the best strategy for Cody Lane is run, don't look back, just keep running. Well, let's face it. Obviously, the American Viking has a size advantage. He's got a height advantage. That leads to a leverage advantage. And look at him unload that chop. Cody Lane is in real trouble right off the bat, Jim. That chop right there, I'm going to tell you what, I just think, I think that just thing just... This man might not last for him. Oh, that just shook the roof of bunkers. And Cody, Cody's in trouble. What an auspicious way to make your debut, and he takes a headbutt right to the sternum. Welcome to the proving ground, Cody Lane. And Rudolph continues to press that size and power advantage, and he is punishing Cody Lane right out of the box, Jim. He is just manhandling him, Brady. Oh, oh listen to that chop. Did I just see the grass, the glass windows break? Yeah. Lane's in trouble. We knew brutal, brutal Viking power with Rudolph, but Cody Lane came in here with a nice reputation. But I tell you what, it's doing him no good. Oh, he, he oh, took no, advantage that's of done. the lack of footwear. Alex Rudolph, uh, one of the uh, rare wrestlers that you're ever going to see that wrestles barefoot, and that uh, came to his disadvantage as the crowd scatters. Oh, and a nice cross body over the top for Lane, and he has Rudolph reeling. And Cody Lane in hot pursuit after feeling the wrath of the Viking from the get-go of this match. He's now finding himself a little offense, and look at him take advantage outside the ring. I'm not going to kid you, though, Tip. Rudolph's dangerous. You don't want to be on the floor. Well, if he wants to uh, gain a win against the man the size, man of the stature of uh, Alex Rudolph, he's going to have to stay on top of him. That's exactly what he's doing. He's taking the fight to him. Oh, he's nice got some chops, chops of his own, but oh! Like I said, look at Rudolph turn the tables on the outside of the ring right there. Rudolph just trying to tear his face off. And not a complete wild wow, man because he stops the count right there. A little wary. A little bit of game planning. And a little bit of punishment as he puts that big, ugly, dirty barefoot right in the face of Cody Lane. Alex Rudolph, uh, part of the famed uh, Viking War Party. They have since, um, I'm not going to say split ways, they've just decided to uh, see oh, what they can do in singles I, action. I but hope you didn't want to buy any merchandise oh. because that table's been cleared off. Come on. Clark, Clark, what did he do that for? 
And I'm not quite sure why Parnell threw that table down on Cody Lane, except for maybe the fact that he used to be a member of that Viking War Party. That's right. Well, I was saying the Vikings, you know, they decided to uh, try their hand at singles action, get themselves some, even some uh, more gold. No appreciation for having the merch table uh, cleaned the off by Parnell. He took repercussions. Cody Lane, he's paying the price. And I tell you what, Alex Reno standing tall and delivered a huge head by well, it's no secret that uh, Jake Parnell and Alex, they're uh, really good friends, possibly even best friends. You know what they do for recreation? They beat, beat the hell up. out of each other. Oh, I thought they found other. It makes perfect sense. Yeah, they beat the hell out of each other just for fun. And Cody Lane, he comes in here with a huge reputation, but, but I'm not going to kid you. Alex Rudolph brought his A game to the proving ground tonight. He is just absolutely hitting on all cylinders. Cody Lane in definite trouble. Oh. He size the strength of Rudolph. But Cody Lane fighting back. There is a lot of heart in Cody Lane. We have seen him on film. We know the reputation. We're aware how good this kid is, but let's face it, that is a hell of a task to find yourself across from with the American Viking. But Cody Lane kicking out. What's Alex Rudolph got in mind? Whatever it is, it's not good. A huge elbow right oh. across the bridge of the nose. That's ugly. And you know, it's Thanksgiving Eve. I think Rudolph just knocked him into Christmas. Big scoop. Bigger slam. Oh. He is just manhandling Cody Lane. Lane is taking a beating right here. He found a few moments of offense early in that, that absolute melee on the floor. But since then, all American Vikings, all Alex Rudolph. Alex Rudolph just dominating this match. Gets an elbow up, does Cody Lane. Managed to get that shoulder up. I don't know how, how seriously Rudolph was looking for the pin at that point. He seems more intent on continuing the punishment. Rudolph with the big claw, backing him up into the corner. He's just gonna rip his face off pretty long. And he pushes the count to the absolute limit. Absolutely holds it to four and a half. Cody Lane, the only thing that holds him up are the ropes, Jim. I don't even think Cody Cody Lane knows where he is right now. Oh, listen to those chops. Everything is going Alex Rudolph's way. Alex, Alex Rudolph just toying him. Alex He's Rudolph calling for something here. He says this is it. He has late compromise, but Lane rolls out of the way. And wait Belly a minute. Back and a big suplex, suplex. Out of nowhere, Whoa. Jim. Where? Where did Cody Lane get that from? Belly to back suplex. Eva's the playing field. Has Rudolph reeling both men down. Both men trying to get to their Cody feet. Cody Lane back to his feet. Duck under, and Lane with a double axe handle. Shakes off the goozle, and it ends a gurry right to the temple, and a big kick to the kneecap, a bicycle kick to the temple. Cody he's, Lane's on a roll, Jim. He's got the big man reeling. Oh my, how did he do that? He's got Rudolph. Showing real wow. power, Lane. Where did he wow. get that strength? And a senton right across him. And going for the cover. Only a two, but great offense from Cody Lane. I cannot believe the strength of Cody Lane lifting up Alex Rudolph like that. Wow, what a display from Cody Lane. What an offensive show. But it doesn't get him the three count. This fight's going on. I think the fans are starting to get behind Cody Lane. Oh, but Cody Lane telegraph, and he got oh, space to the canvas. That could be it. 
Ball hold by Alex Rudolph. Alex Rudolph is obsessed with delivery punishment when maybe he should have gone for the pin. Barely getting the shoulder up. Two and a half Lane gets the shoulder up off of that claw hole, but he look he escaped the claw huge jab. Reversal. And it's a oh three. my god! It's a three out of nowhere. Cody Did Lane I just see what that. I just saw? I've been drinking too much PBR. How did he Not do that? Not at all. Cody Lane debuts in the proving ground with a huge win over Alexander Rudolph. What a huge debut by Cody Lane, victorious over the big man Alex Rudolph. 